<laughs> it's huge. Wow. Is it heavy? No, no, it's not too bad. Oh, amazing. Less than six p an hour to run. Cheaper than running the radiators. Wheels to put it on. Pegs to hang them out. Mesh shelf. Oh, like a big curtain over it. Ah, oh, so you don't even have to look at it all. Really good, <laughs> really good. I love it. We literally asked you to air your laundry in public. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And which issues were you hoping it would solve for you? Well, we don't have a dryer at the moment, no. so okay. to dry the clothes, we generally put the central heating on. So yeah. We drape clothes over the radiators, banisters. Well, that's one of the reasons why we wanted to get at you. It's rather large. You've got 21 metres of drying space on it once you add up all the bars. So plenty of room for all your family's washing. Yeah. We asked you to try out the dry soon for a week, which, if your household is anything like mine, is around 273 wash loads. <laughs> Not far off. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see how you got on with that. It doesn't look like we have to put anything together. I it looks like it just opens up. It looks like it uh, just folds. On this side as well? Yep. OK, glad we don't have to, like, screw things together. I <laughs> know. <laughs> I must be middle aged getting excited about the dryer. <laughs> I wonder how much stuff you can get on there and how quick it'd actually dry it. We'll look forward to uh, giving this a go, I think, won't we? We were excited to give the dryer a first little try, so we're just going to throw it on for half an hour before bed to do a couple of today's washing. Let's go. The lead seems quite short. We're just going to turn it on for now. Go. The inside one's getting warm already. The bars themselves do heat up. They're not too hot for the kids to touch. I'm not worried about leaving it lying around that the kids get it into themselves. Being on wheels, it was easy to manoeuvre around. Gonna zip it down and then I'm off to bed. The light load did dry and in a reasonable time. The full load, not so much. I'm gonna give these towels a, a go on the dryer this afternoon. It's another rainy day out there, so. This would have been a case of draping them over the banisters and over all the radiators with the heating on. Right, so that's the towels wash done and dried. It's probably taken about eight hours, maybe. It took longer than we sort of expected it to. It does dry there. It does yeah. dry in the end, but yeah. We've been given this electric uh, monitoring uh, plug to uh, see how much energy it uses. It does claim on the box that it's uh, 6p an hour, so I'll be uh, keen to see if that's... Uh, True or not, plug it in and uh, get it going. It's got a timer on the top there, so that's good. It's uh, been an hour, so let's see how much uh, power we've used. 0 0.361 kilowatts. So I've checked on the internet our tariff. We're on 29.58 kilowatt hours. So I'll uh, times this by 6, 2. Yeah, 10.7p was what we were getting yeah. out of it. Yeah, which is, like, it's closer to double the price quoting, but, you know, the prices have gone off. I don't know when those claims were made. Well, I like to uh, could drive it in one place rather than all over the radiators and banisters, so that yeah. an improvement. Yeah, so that was definitely an improvement. It's definitely not as fast as the radiator. Hi. Is it warm there, is it? You know, the cats like to it took the chill off the room in the mornings. It has meant we haven't had to put our heat on. It's a win for us. It's a win, yeah, it's a win. So it was a win. I'm really pleased to hear that. Yeah, I would say so, yeah. You mentioned on the film there that the towels took about eight hours to dry. Was that always the average amount of time for, for a wash load? When you filled all of the bars, it did take a while, yeah. And you would have to take the stuff that was dry off to make more rooms. It's quite easy to do that as well, with yeah. all the drying in one place. So you're not, yeah. you're not traipsing around the house and turning them on radiators. You are doing yeah. it in that one area, so it made it a lot easier. Yeah, so you liked having that sort of one drying station yeah. compared to it being sort of... Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, yeah. Different rooms. Yeah. And the cats liked it as the well. The cats loved it, <laughs> yeah. It did take the chill off the room a little yeah, bit. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. And the running costs, 10 p as opposed to 6 so still attractive? Yeah, I think so, yeah. I certainly, mean, certainly cheaper than putting the central heating on. It definitely made a big difference because we've not had our heating on, really, other than when the kids are in the bath or, you know, something where you, you need to be warm. We haven't had to put it on. OK, so I can reveal the price to you. 
It costs £239. That is quite reasonable for, okay. for like, for long-term solution. Yes, yeah. it doesn't seem excessive. No, it does, definitely doesn't seem excessive, now. You know what? It's not the most glamorous piece of technology, <laughs> but it makes a big difference to your it life. Does, yeah, yeah, it does make really things easier, yeah. yeah.